Good morning, y'all. So I just submitted this scholarship for my job, right? Hold on, let me open these wines up. Did that? Okay, it's a little better. But um, I just submitted this scholarship for my job. If y'all don't know, I work at McDonald's, hashtag nine to five clean for right now. But, and I've been working for McDonald's since I was 15 years old. So if I do not get accepted for this scholarship, I'm quitting. Because first off, I feel like y'all should be paying my whole tuition. Hashtag McDonald's make it happen. But I'm not even gonna push it because beggars can't be choosers. But if I don't get if I don't get uh what's it called accepted for the scholarship, I'm really gonna like have a couple words for the owner of both of the stores that I work for. Cause like what's up? What's up? But anyways, hi, good morning, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Nevaeh Mache and welcome. Now, the last couple videos have been, I wouldn't say trash, but they have been like blah, like truly blah. So this video is gonna be 10 times better, hopefully. But as I can see, I've already got ready because getting ready uh, and recording kind of slows down the, the vibe but I really don't have anything planned today I'm supposed to get my hair done <laughs> fingers crossed y'all because like my hair it doesn't look horrible but it looks bad so it doesn't look too bad to where I'm like staying in the house because I'm hair depressed because even if I don't get my hair done today the weekend shall continue but at the same time it's not I'm not going to feel as confident if my hair is not done if you get it, you get it. If you don't, you know. The girls that know, they know. So hopefully, fingers crossed, Lord, Jesus, Heavenly Father, Lord, please. I need my hair done. But, and then um, I want to go to Applebee's. If y'all know, Applebee's is like the McDonald's of the freaking, of the freaking sit-down restaurant. But I've been craving spinach artichoke, artichoke dip, so I'm going to go get it, even if I got to go get it by myself. So yeah, I'm gonna go to Applebee's probably like tonight, tonight, like for dinner or something. And just yeah. Um, but yeah, that's all that really I got uh going on for today. Tomorrow it's a different story, but we'll get into that tomorrow. Um oh also today, Elena is actually on her way because we're gonna do a study test a study session. If y'all don't know, I took a CCMA class and that's why I was in school for two hours, remember? back when i was in high school the last semester i only went to school for two hours like for the morning time i went to school because i was taking a ccma class and we had a big if y'all don't know what a ccma class is a clinical certified medical assistant it's like you work in a doctor's office basically you feel me so um at the end of the year at the end of the semester we took this big exam and i felt it by 10 points and so i'm gonna retake it and i'm gonna keep retaking it until i pass this test because I literally would have if it didn't matter to me then I wouldn't have went to school you feel me because I didn't have to I just chose to because this mattered to me you feel me as a medical assistant I could work in a doctor's office I could work in a dermatologist's office and if y'all don't know I want to be a dermatologist so if I could work in a dermatologist's office before I actually get that degree then that would be perfect for me I would have the experience I would know what to do what not to do you feel me and yeah so I'm gonna have to retake this test, child, in a couple weeks. So me and Elena, me and Elena are about to be studying like crazy. Today we probably only do an hour today because it's like the first day, and it's like really. I feel like, I feel like me giving y'all to do list helps me actually pick up my camera because instead of me not being like I don't know what I'm gonna do today, but we'll see. I never pick up this. I will never pick up this phone and record. But because I'm giving y'all to do list, it's like dang, I told them I'm gonna do this, so let me at least try to do this. So that's all for right now. Um, I'm gonna pick y'all back up probably when landing gear or something or when we're done studying because I just assist and educate patients on how to perform everyday tasks after a physical. That's a medical assistant? Mm -mm. Physician assistant is one of the therapists. Well, read the, reread the question. Assist and educate patients on how to perform everyday tasks after a physical. Physical therapist? Is it a physical therapist? Occupational therapist? Ah! Mm -hmm. Okay. A urine specimen collected in a clean container for screening purposes. No preparation is required. What is that? A urine analysis. No. Say it again. Wait, it might be the fifth thing, but that's not what I put down. 
uh, a urine specimen collected in a clean container for screening purposes. No, pre no preparation is needed. What type of test is this? Drug test? Mm -mm. Think of all. Um... Ooh, what the fat? <laughs> okay, think of what? All the urine tests. Pregnancy tests? Not all of them are bad. I mean, not a pregnancy test ain't bad. I mean, to check for a UCI? Mm -mm. A urine specimen collected in a clean container. All, all of you. What am I emphasizing <laughs> that for? All of I hope they do it. <laughs> for screening purposes. That's what I need to be emphasizing. For screen. screening purposes. Mm -hmm. Can you give me a hint? No preparation is required. What do they mean by preparation? Like, so when you go get, say, like S C D testing, you know how you got to wipe the side and wipe the middle. And then why no the, preparation is required. No right. And you gotta drink, you got you can't eat, you know how some tests you gotta like you can't eat, yeah. you can't drink nothing, so think of all the tests. Just it's it's me. really random. It's called random urine testing. That's really what it's called. The random urine testing. <laughs> Give me this. <laughs> I'm at Applebee's what lane is it? So it's look at the time, look at the time, y'all. It's it's early. We was gonna come later, like dinner, dinner type. But our stomach started touching our back, so we decided to cut it a little early. And if we get hungry later tonight, we just gonna eat the leftovers or just cook something. But right now we're at Applebee's. Uh, Lisha is obviously not with me right now. Um, hopefully, fingers crossed. Oh, thank you. Thank you. And then. She did not, she's not with us yet, but hopefully after we can go pick her up. She don't like Applebee's anyway, so I guess it was a win. I don't like Applebee's either, but I was craving that little plaque. Y'all finna see. But um, still don't get my hair done. And I got plans tomorrow. I'm planning to be outside. We got our food, y'all. Is this big of us? Like, this is a lot of food. It's okay. It's big. Uh-uh. These look a little old. I have this order. This is what I'm excited about. Oh. This is what I'm excited about. It's hot. Mommy, there's no reason to cry. No one's getting better. We're going to put it in a box to go. Mm. Mm-hmm. Exactly how I imagined it. I don't know. No one's told anything. This is what you're going to tell us about the food that you're going to eat. okay guys i'm back home my head is looking like i gotta get cute because i look like a mcdonald's worker right now but everybody say hi i'm gonna get in the shower we're gonna go to the fair um what's i gonna say i'm looking for something to wear i kind of want to wear something different than a black top and my ones but it's just like i don't have no summer clothes yet still so i don't know but i want to update you guys because y'all know i'm trying to keep up with the blogging because y'all already know y'all already know but i'm gonna get in the shower and i'm gonna talk to y'all when i get out we made it to the fair everybody say hi we're gonna do a foot hey check we're gonna start with lena so go down the line mm -hmm. okay yeah. and then here's target pants from forever 21 and shoes i don't know i got them from like goat maybe last time ago but we here. How long we plan on being here? Are we gonna get no out any rocks? Yeah. I'm a I little scared. You I'm a little scared. Yeah, I'm really a scary cat. Like, why? Like these rods came out of suitcases. Are we serious? Are you serious? We just gonna walk around and look. Nah, the suitcase. We waited in the line. We didn't even have to because we had bar tickets online. But why is them tickets? A sheet of tickets is like almost thirty dollars. Twenty tickets is thirty dollars. Like, do the math. I don't even think that makes sense. It's a rip off, but I guess. Um, so we don't plan on getting on no like a lot of rods because like I told y'all, like these rods come out the suitcase, like no shade to them, but like no. oh, can I try? Yeah, yeah. Here. So you so if we drop it by the green, we get a book up? Yep. Go Lena. So, still you got one more shot. Thank you. 
Thank you. Individually at 12 and bottom, but since I stopped and listened to me, got my sister's quick for $6 a week. Roughly. Okay. 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 They got, they just gave us a Bible. I love stuff like this, like, seeing people out, spreading the word. That makes me happy. I'm gonna try this lip gloss. This is the one I got, the glitter one. It ain't lying. It never, but this is like my basic This one looks good. This looks disgusting. I don't like Oreos. Actually, this Boston cream one looks good. Elena. It looks like a Show me your burger list. On a scale of one to ten. Here, show me one. These fries are soggy. If they was like fresh hot out the grease, they would be good. But I, I got onions and jalapenos on there. This is a, this is my perfect bite, but it's like soggy, like they old fries. But it's hard. I had to give them to Lisha. They are salty as everything. I don't know if it's the cheese, but I'm eating the jalapenos off of them. But that, like the fries itself is salty. It's just, it's good. But we sitting down. We really trying to wait till it get dark so we can get on another ride or two. The Ferris wheel. The Ferris wheel. All right. Look, y'all. I'm ready for that. I'm gonna cook. I'm gonna cook for them tonight. I'm gonna show y'all. But I'm ready for a funnel cake. I need something sweet. Okay, I'm ready for this funnel cake. I got the cookie dough. A regular uh, powdered sugar funnel cake with a little bit extra powdered sugar. Thank you. Good morning, y'all. It's Sunday, the next day, and y'all. Y'all already know what I'm finna. Y'all already know what I'm doing, getting ready for church. But I want to show y'all this book that Beans let me borrow. I know y'all know who this lovely woman is, Miss Sarah Jakes. So yeah, I will. I read the first couple of pages like a couple weeks ago, and it, it was just like everything I thought it would be. So I'm excited to indulge in this book. But right now, me and Lashar are getting ready for church, and I just want to come on here and, and tell y'all about last night. It was a six out of ten. It could have been worse. It could have been better. It was supposed to rain, but I was at work, and I was like, "Oh God, please don't let it rain," because y'all know how in the Bible Elijah asked God to stop the rain, and it didn't rain, or something like that. Something like that. But so yeah, it was supposed to rain on the forecast. It was it was it was saying it was raining, but it wasn't raining where I was at. So that was a plus. But I don't know y'all. I don't know if it's because I had just got off of work or whatever the case may be. But I I wasn't irritated the whole time. But being around a lot of people irritated me, and it it usually does. But not it it really does at the same time. Yeah, if y'all get what I'm trying to say, like I know how to act accordingly. But like when I get around like too many people and I'm tired. And the people are not acting accordingly. It just throws me. It don't throw me off. It just like irritates me. If y'all know, I'm a homebody. I usually stay at home. And I don't like to be the party pooper or anything like that. But when irritation hits, the irritation hits. And then I was just telling my friend last night, like, I'm one of the, I'm, I'm, my problem is, because this is, this has something to do with the fear. Like, like it was a lot of kids there. And my problem is, I expect people's maturity level to be as high as mine. And not everybody, and it's nothing wrong with, with your maturity level not being mature at all. But that's just how I be thinking. And it just really just throws me off when everybody not. But like I said, we're finna get ready for church, y'all. I'm going to pick you guys back up after church to let you know what I get into, if I get into something or not. Now, it ain't going to be dark forever. And the moment the lights come back on, I'm going to be prepared to get the victory. Every now and again, God will allow some darkness to set in to develop you so that he can push you to your destiny. Hey guys, um, it's actually Tuesday, but it's also the 4th of July. So happy Independence Day to any and everybody who celebrates it. But this sun is like sunny and I know y'all probably like, put them glasses on that's on top of your head. I can't see with these glasses on. 
So, um, but anyways, like I said, it's Independence Day. Hold up. I'm sorry if y'all can't hear me. And I know this lighting is horrible, but this sun is sunny, as I said. But, um, it's Independence Day. But I'm on my way to go see The Little Mermaid by myself. I've been waiting for this movie to come out. And I have not yet to go see it because I've been waiting for somebody to go with me. So I'm like, what better day to go than today? There's nobody else going to be in the theater. I already checked online. I tried to buy my tickets online and it just wouldn't let me. So I'm just going to, it's not like I'm going to be standing in line or nothing. So I'm just going to go. I actually kind of sad. I kind of wanted to experience it with somebody. But hey, things happen, as I always say. And I'm not going to let this hold me back any much longer. So yeah, I'm on my way to go see The Little Mermaid. I should have went to go get me some snacks. Because y'all know how the movie theater be taxing over a freaking snack and I really don't like movie theater popcorn I don't like popcorn at all but they swear up and down that that stuff be fresh and it just be tasting old like real old and it look old too but no more complaining I just actually got off of work work was cool I think I got like an hour overtime in today so too too to me but I am tired y'all I've been living off of Red Bull for the last couple days that I've been working and it, it's, it helps but it just makes me like real jittery and it gets my heart beating real fast and that makes me like feel like I'm gonna pass out. Now I know that's kind of backwards but y'all I don't know what it is but I can't intake it too much you feel me? or I gotta drink it with water which is crazy like what the heck but as I said two times before or maybe three on the way to the theater I'm not gonna record of course that's illegal but I will like you know pick up a few clips here and there. I just want to catch y'all up this actually um because I was supposed to do something Sunday but I end up just chilling cleaning you know how Sundays be and yeah it was just a it was just a chill day Sunday I just slept and went to church all of that good stuff so I'm just gonna uh, throw this footage in the footage from the weekend so I can get a full vlog this weekend and yeah I'm gonna talk to y'all when I get to the theater. Okay guys, so that's the end of this video. Um, but before I end the video, I wanna say, if you have not want to go watch The Little Mermaid, literally go watch it because it the movie was so good. And it's a Disney movie, so you wouldn't think of 18 year old I know, I know i know a lot of adults want to go see it but like the way that i enjoyed it i thought i was like six year old me i used to be obsessed with the little mermaid i used to carry this doll around everything i left her at the pool and haven't heard from her since <laughs> but yes y'all i'm not gonna say too much about it because a lot of people haven't seen it but if you have not seen it go watch it it was such a good movie but with all that being said thank you guys so much for watching this video do not forget to like and subscribe tell a friend and tell a friend leave a comment down below and follow my social medias which will also be in the description again i thank you guys so much for watching do not forget to thank god period 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 that's the most important thing that you should be doing as soon as you wake up before you touch your phone before you take a drink of water say thank you lord for giving me another day thank you lord for giving me another chance and before you lay your head down and call it a day. Thank you, Lord, for getting me through this day. With all that being said, I love you guys. See you in the next one. Bye.